fun statistics and pie chart portion of this video, Rinsey inspired me and many others to consider and be more mindful of our reading, of our diversity, of the genders that we read. This has kind of been a hot topic in the book community, not just on the internet, but in general. So that forced me to take a look at my own numbers, and I'm going to share those with you today. I was very pleased to look at my gender numbers because 58% of the books that I have read in 2014 were written by women, and most of the books I'm going to read in the near future are also written by women, so I think that as far as that's concerned, I'm doing well, and it's it's much higher than I expected. I'm pretty proud of that. The next number I have to show you is not one that I'm very proud of. At this time, I've read 55 books, and only eight of those books were written by people of color, and a couple of those were repeats, like a couple of them were books written by the same author. I aim to improve upon that number. I don't know how much by the end of this year, but I think that my goals for next year will probably have a lot to do with diversity and not so much about page numbers. I really need to dwell on reading things from different perspectives, different cultures, so that I can broaden my own perspective. And last, but certainly not least, I made a pie chart. I did this actually a couple of months ago, but I did it again with all of the new numbers to see kind of where I fell as far as genres were concerned. So my numbers are, I've, according to my Goodreads, and some of these overlap, but I'll just go with it. I've read five children's books, 19 young adult books, nine graphic novels, four classics, four pieces of nonfiction or collections of essays, and 13 general literary or genre fiction, such as fantasy or sci-fi. I really had no idea what to expect. I kind of thought my YA number would be much higher, which I'm pleased with this regardless. And that's all that I have to share with you today. I hope that you enjoyed this video. As always, please feel free to share your thoughts on anything that I shared here today in the comments below. I will see you soon with a new video.